Okay, let's get you, let's get you, and... Oh no, what? <laughs> Rope. <gasps> My god! I did it! No. Okay. That is cool. Don't really want to waste an arrow, but it's done now. Arrow roulette. What's happening guys, welcome back to the channel. It is 444 here, and today we're gonna to be having a little bit different of an episode from what we're used to. Um, nothing specific in mind, we're just going to start exploring the crafting system that is available to us. Obviously a pretty big part of the survival craft style game is crafting. And we've got these little nifty things. So um, we just want to make our lives a little bit easier. So we've got our rain collectors. We want to build a bit of fire as well. And then let's have a little B&I. Always with a bloody B&I. So all of our meat appears to be edible for now. So let's... Um, Slapping over fire. Um, not too sure if it's worth a little sleep actually to get daytime upon us. Let's eat this up, whatever comes out. Come on. Will it still let us sleep? No. It looks like it actually wants to wait a certain amount of time before we can sleep. So we'll just make a start. It's no sweat. Okay, that one bit of meat actually did us to a full stomach from half. So um, bear that in mind for next time. Also waiting for daytime to approach. Let us have a little basics of survival. Okay, we know this little thing. Let's have a little look at what we've actually got. Oh, Jesus Christ, he's a biggie. Okay. So what's that? That's a bonfire, fire pit. I assume that's just basically same as a fire, but you know, it's gonna last a fair bit longer. Stand in fire, presumably to light your way. We could probably line this beach with some nice stand in fires. Okay, shelters. Probably wanna build a little um a little cabin. Log cabin. Yeah, oh, I think so. It's about time. We we know the place where we're to. It's quite nice. We got our little um, boat escape point. God forbid. We got a village nearby. Um, I'm, I'm presuming. Yeah, we need a better fire. I'm presuming that the freaks respawn. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm not too sure how many rocks we. In fact. I won't build a, oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> I won't build a more permanent fire until we've got our log cabin kind of um, decided where we're gonna have him. So, let's get him. Might seem a bit pointless, but uh, I don't want to get him tragically dark when there's freaks about. So, that's why I'm doing it. All right. So food, rabbit cage, so we could place a couple of them inside for woods. Water collector, we got some, but we'll make it a bit nice. Uh, drying rack, presumably for meat, so you can dry it out. Garden, I don't know if we've picked up any seeds yet. Maybe we can plant the actual plants that we're foraging. I'm not too sure. Um, but yeah, two, two logs for a small little plot. You know, can't really go amiss there. Storage. This is what we need. So this is obviously what you're gonna sit in your in your little base. So I'm thinking we're gonna wall it, like fence it off a little bit. 
get a stick holder, log holder, rock holder, so we can store all of our items. The log sled is presumably because you can only carry two or three logs at a time. So the log sled is going to allow you to carry more. Not too sure how many more, but we shall find out soon enough. 21 sticks. Weapon rack. Okay, so we can um, alter our clubs. I'm, I'm sure there's different weapons in the game. Explosives holder. Maybe down the line. We'll, we'll get our little mat out in a minute and just have a little explore on that. Um, okay, small cabinet. No idea. Probably put food on it. Don't see the point in a small cabinet when a large cabinet's one more log. And it's got an extra shelf. That seems like dead space there. It's the interior designer in me. <laughs> well, probably not interior design, more uh, efficiency. Right, skin rack. So you can put all your pelts up here. Cool. Bone basket. Basically, we, we want all of this stuff. Armor rack. We haven't got any armor, but it's not going to go amiss. Arrow basket. We need to make some arrows. And I assume it's going to be a feather, stick, and maybe a sharpened up stone. I'm not too sure. Probably a bit of tree sap. But we will check it in a mo. Custom. Not going to bother right now. <laughs> nice little gazebo. Uh, rock wall, rock path. Stick fence, bone fence. These look more kind of aesthetic rather than anything else. A tree house. Mm. Alpine tree house, tree bridge, tree platform. Once we go into a forest, we'll probably have to have a second base. I'm gonna, gonna have to go into like destroy that little hut that we had before because he's just a waste of a heads up display marker really no basic wall with door blah 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 utility so stick marker okay no wooden target cool little bit of practice tree sap collector okay so you can actually string that up on a tree and it's just going to collect sap for you that's pretty cool climbing rope cool freestanding zip line that's really cool. I really like that. Uh, I wonder if the freaks can use that. I'm not too sure. Uh, tree zip line. How, how, like, I, I don't know how you can kind of navigate these trees. Clearly there's a way. Um, okay, bench, table, bed. I'd build a bed, you know. In fact, that's the point. If I build a small cabin, am I... I presume I'm going to need a bed because it's not specifically for sleeping. Um, fireplace. Side table is getting a bit over the top now. Earskin rug, very nice. Got some lovely stuff. Head trophy. Okay. Weapon display. Uh, wall planter. Fancy bone chandelier, stick frame, birdhouse. That's cute. That is that is quite cute, actually. I think we need one of them. Um, okay, a couple of little leaf pile trap. What's, what's this going to catch? I think it's rabbit cage. Do we store rabbits in there or do we catch rabbits in there? I've lost the trap now. Okay. Wire traps. So this is obviously for freaks. Uh, deadfall. No idea how that's working. If anyone knows, feel free to chuck it down in the comments. I'll make it up at some point. So, um, happy birthday trap. We should make that in that cave next to the pinata. Um, from the last episode, if you checked it out. Rope swing, trap, cool, noose. That's pretty. Speaks for itself. Catapult. Come on, that just is mental. How tall are these? Okay, it's pretty tall. I'm not 100% how well it will keep the guys out, whether they can break it down. But this is clearly going to be where we start. Maybe get some spikes on the outside so they can't climb it all freakily, freaky deaky. Uh, wall spikes. Okay. Boats and stuff like that. Large raft, dark house boat. Cool. A nice SOS sign we 
custom effigy large arm. Is this... Okay. We'll wait until we've lost our sanity a little bit. It's, it's kind of... um. In fact, let's go back on it. Okay, we, we can build it now. Um, just thought, you know, it's got blood and stuff over it. I thought maybe um, <laughs> maybe it had to get a bit crazy before you got onto that. Still got to find the boy, set up a defence, which we're about to do. Um, and still feeling good. Sanity, 100%. That's, that's pretty good. Athleticism. Not too sure if we can level that up. Armour, cold armour, stealth is crap because we haven't actually done anything. And are they coloured in when we find them? Because we found aloe in the last. Okay. Uh, yeah, we did see Dory. Okay. It's a freaky dickies. Right. So that is the survival book, or whatever you want to call it. And what we do want to check out here is, because you can literally chuck stuff down here. Okay, Molotov, what's that? That's booze and cloth. That is the simplest thing in the world. And it, it's legit, ain't it? What, what is a Molotov? It's, it's just like a wine bomb, ain't it? So something to set a light to, a fuse, and something that ignites. Own armour. We can build that by the looks. Um, in fact, apparently we can build the Molotov too. I can't see. <gasps> no. There we are. There we are. Yes. I found the quick combine. That is good news. Got a compass from the last episode. That's good. Uh, refills torch. That's handy if we had a torch. Okay. Okay, that's our map, but we've got... It says cave map, so does it not work outside? Got a ton of arrows. Um, got some rocks, got some other crap. An old pot. I imagine that'll come in handy. Right, where were we? So, burning weapon. Hmm. Crafted bow. Okay. Uh, upgraded spear. Okay. Uh, incendiary arrows that is oh, um, I'm overwhelmed spear bag What's, why, why do we need a spear bag for a spear I suppose you can have more than one spear that would make sense um, ok so bow is rope cloth and a stick do we have sticks we did have sticks. Where's our sticks? There's our sticks. Don't know why I'm walking away. That's um, not required, is it? Okay, let's get you. Let's get you. And... Oh, no. What? <laughs> Rope. Oh my god! We did it! No. Okay. That is cool. Don't really want to waste an arrow, but it's done now. Arrow roulette. <laughs> I don't let you do it. Peaks at about 50. Um, 50 degrees, that is. Do we recollect the arrow? We most certainly can. That is sweet. We're going to have to kill some birds. Okay, no. What were we doing to build the arrows? Let's check that out. So. Um, okay, you can add some kind of berry or fire to the arrows. That's pretty cool. Uh, it's obviously going to be a stick, isn't it? Of which we have ran out. So let's get the axe out. Get some sticks. With the help of a friend and a stick or two. Some arrows were made for hunting after you. 
With a friend and a stick or three or four We'll have range combat where we didn't before There you have it, lamest reference known to man You know, are they? Did I put them in there or are they just appearing? Were they in there before? Maybe they were I must have just missed it Anyway, yep, I'm not 100% if I'm going to upload it fully Maybe montage it to add the tasteful music we got off a boat um, well, obviously this is an important as very very important aspect of the game but it's probably not the most interesting thing for the majority of people so, yeah. I don't know oh, I'll just oh, do it and see what becomes of it so let's chuck down some sticks and see so arrows is that Feathers? It's feathers, so... It's not like crossed out, though. Should it be crossed out if... Deer skin, clothing... Lizard skin... Bones and stuff... I don't know, I, I figured it would have shaded out items if, you know, if, if you can use it. Um, takes... Oh. Ah, you stupid. I'm just equipping it instead of combining it. Snowshoes. Oh my god, this gets intense. I, I don't know how, like, hefty the enemies are going to end up getting... Presumably, it's going to get pretty tragic at some point because crafted apps, is, is that going to be better than a regular one? Should we check them out? Okay, fine. Mm, it's going to be a no, isn't it? <laughs> it's, going to, it's going to be a pretty definite no there. So speed, half, damage, what's that? Like a third, block, a fifth. We get you. Okay, damage is good and block is good as well, actually. So maybe it's pretty good. Uh, we can increase the speed with a feather and some sap. Okay. Take him off. Plain ads. So. Overwhelming, to say the least. All right, we've got a circuit board. We can make a proper, like, detonatable, timed explosive there. So that's what the circuit board's about. Chuck on tape. That's good. Chainsaw with light. Flintlock pistol with light. Slingshot. Okay. I think the bow's going to do a lot better than the slingshot. What, what are the coins going to do? Okay, that's for the explosive. Used to stoke fires, that's cool. Um, let's have a look what was on cloth again. So. Presumably these are going to show up some. Okay, we've got a warm suit. That requires a lot of pelts. Yeesh. Right, uh, clothing outfit. Don't know what I'm wearing at the moment, but has that got some kind of stat? No, nope, it hasn't. So it's just clothes for the sake. Stewardess dress, that's cool. Camo t-shirt and beige. Yeah, let's go for that. And lizard skin. Stealth armor. So it requires 15 feathers. I'm sorry, leaves, leaves, leaves. Where the hell are the leaves? We definitely do have leaves. So, okay, there we are. How many was it? I uh, don't know where we are. Let's have a look. Stealth. 
stealth armor. Let's going to increase both our armor and our stealth as simple as that leaves and bloody whatever else it was lizard skin that's all it took look at that look at that fist that is sweet okay so we got a better understanding of what's actually kind of out there for us to potentially build and achieve so i'm gonna leave it there guys hope you all enjoyed if there's anything that you saw that you'd like me to build just let us know hit us up in the comments all the best bye guys